I'm Sasha Muller, PC Pro's Deputy Reviews Editor. And I'm Barry Collins, Editor of PC Pro. And today we've got with us Lenovo's ThinkPad Helix, which is Lenovo's first Windows 8 uh, business hybrid. As you can see, it looks the traditional ThinkPad, all finished in matte black. And uh, inside and out, that goes for inside and out. Of course, you've got the little red track point on the side, in the middle rather. Click the button there. It turns into an 11.6 inch Full HD tablet. I really like this as a hybrid because the tablet is heavier than some of the slates we've seen, but not too heavy. It still feels comfortable to hold. And with the full keyboard, I think that's just a, a really good solution. It's, uh, uh, it works well as a laptop and works well as a tablet. It's quite a powerful device as well, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, e even the starting, well, the entry level model is a Core i5. The one we've got here is a Core i7, uh, 8 gigs of RAM. So, yeah, there's not much you can't throw at it. Unlike some of the other tablets we've seen, even the Lenovo Mix we saw last week, this actually comes with a stylus as well. And if I can uh, actually pluck it out of the device, as you can see, it's, it's stowed within the tablet itself. It's not left to, on an awkward magnetic clip like the Surface Pro or just left dangling in the box. They thought about all aspects of the design. Yeah, it definitely looks like a promising uh, combination of both worlds. I mean, as we said, we've uh, criticised some machines like the Yoga for permanently having the keyboard attached. This the fact you can separate it, and let's not forget there's a battery in the base as well, it means you've got the best of both worlds. Do you want a light tablet you can take anywhere, or do you want a fully fledged laptop? You've got them both. You can even slot it in backwards in the, in the holster, so it's a little bit awkward, but once you clunk it in, if you're watching a movie on the train, uh, you can just turn it around and, and put the keyboard out of the way, and, you, and you've got a stand. Even if you're working at home, you can put an external keyboard into the front here because the, uh, the ports are all on the back, and uh, work away without the distraction of the, uh, the base keyboard. I guess the next question you're probably asking, after thinking, yes, I want one of those, is <laughs> how much does it cost? Uh, the entry level price for the i5, uh, 4 gigs RAM, 128 gig model, and that's no mobile broadband, is around £1,340, ranging right up to £1,800 for the Core i7 3G equipped model we've got here. It's definitely not cheap, but I still think it's one of the hottest Windows 8 devices we've seen yet. Yep, I'll have two.